<laughs> Are you upset? What happened? So as most of you know, uh, we've been dealing with fleas for quite some time now. Um, they're not that bad. I don't see any on our carpet. I never see any on us. We don't have any bites. I just, he's always so itchy. Um, I think it's calmed down a little bit, but I brush him with a flea comb about every day and I catch at least one every day. Um, and then this past week I was brushing him and I was catching like 20 um, the other day. So someone told me to bathe him in apple cider vinegar which I did and then you can make like a spray of water in apple cider vinegar and I tried that and it didn't help at all. I was noticing more fleas afterwards. I don't know if that had anything to do with it or not but I did read he's so tired. He's been stressed out. He got a bath. He's been covered in oil. He gets stressed out when he, when he takes a bath. He gets very sleepy. But yeah I read that um, if you put coconut oil all over them, it kind of slows down the fleas a bit because they can't walk through the coconut oil. And then if you leave it on for a while, it will kill them after a while, is what I read. I didn't read that it doesn't kill them. I was like, you know what, I'm just gonna try it. So I put coconut oil all over him. And then I thought, you know what, why don't I just leave it on him for a while? The article said to leave it on. I saw people say to leave it on for a few hours. I saw someone say to leave it on for eight hours. Um, I left it on for about two days and then today I gave him a bath, a flea bath. So I rinsed off all the coconut oil and put a flea shampoo on him. What is? Can't see you. And then um, I let him dry off a little bit. He was still a little wet and I put more coconut oil all over him especially like in the armpit areas and around his neck and his butt where the fleas usually hang out. And I'll probably leave this on again for like two days and then we'll rinse and we'll repeat. But I kind of figure that the fleas are not gonna go on him like that or they're gonna get trapped in the oil. Um, so hopefully this works. Maybe I found the flea trick, I don't know. So far he's not as itchy and I know his skin is very irritated so the coconut oil probably feels so good on his skin and it's making him nice and soft. And when I'm putting it on I drop some sometimes and he loves coconut oil so he's gotten a lot of coconut oil in the past few days. Right? But we blocked off our room so he can't go on the carpet. We obviously can't cuddle with him. I know he hates that. Hopefully this will help and this will be all over. But yeah, obviously I can't really make an exciting video. He He's sleepy and oily. We don't need to stress him out anymore. But I thought I'd give you guys a little update. Oh, this oily guy. I put tons back here because that's where they usually hang out. But yeah, other than that, we're good. Ignore my purple broken pixel right there. Ew. It's actually easier to brush him when his hair's like this. So I can get the flea comb through him easier. But yeah, I'll have a little update next week on how the flea situation is going. Hopefully this goes away in the next month. say bye everybody make sure you subscribe give us a like comment below yeah all right back to bed